Welcome to this episode of In Your Face News. Today we're going to be covering the timeline of the evolution of audio in television. Right now we're going to kick it on scene with JP talking about Thomas Edison's contribution. Good evening ladies and gentlemen, I'm Jameson Parker with In Your Face News. If you're enjoying this right now, that is the audio and video synced presentation that you're viewing, it's because technology is advanced to allow us to enjoy these two mediums together. There was a time way back when it used to be enjoyed on two separate types of technology. If you're enjoying this right now, you know who you owe thanks to? None other than Thomas Edison. Before sound and moving picture were combined, they were enjoyed via two separate devices, the phonograph, which was just an audio device, and the kinetoscope, a device designed to allow motion pictures to be viewed one at a time through a peephole viewer at the top. Thomas Edison and his employee, William Dixon, combined these two technologies to create the kinetophone, kinetoscopes with phonographs in their cabinets. Here's a clip of the first known experiment to synchronize sound and movie. Thanks, Thomas Edison. We really appreciate the type of technology that allows us to even do presentations like this. Back to you, Philip. You know, working in the news, you think you know everything, but Thomas Edison sure knows how to throw you a curveball. Right now, we're going to kick off to THE Skywalker, yes ladies, the real one, talking about surround sound and its contribution to television. This week's cheer goes to Dominic Bertrand, French engineer who worked with Solid State Logic to create their 5.1 surround sound. This was based on their 5000 series that included six channels, left, right, center, left rear, right rear, and bass. This was used in the famous French cabaret Moulin Rouge in 1987. Bertrand already made a, a 3.1 surround system in 1974 for their international summit of Francophone states in Dakar, Senegal. So thank you, Dominique. Cheers. Back to you, Phil. Wow, I am learning a lot on today's episode. Mr. Know-it-all himself does not know it all. Who knew that the French could invent? Me? No, I did not. Sadly, we're going to have to kick it to a word from our sponsors. See you when we get back. Hi there, this is Adam Price coming to you live from Florida for Cornucopia. We're going to go ask some uh, people over here for, for their best jokes. Hey there, sir. Sir, do you have a second? Uh, we were just wondering what your best joke might be. My best joke? Knock, knock. Who's there? Oh. Oh. Your mama's so fat. <laughs> a bus hit her and she's like, who threw that rock? Oh. <laughs> oh. Yeah, yeah. Anybody else? Best joke? joke? Let's hear him. How many tickles does it take to make a squid laugh? I don't know. Ten tickles. <laughs> <laughs> and that's coming to you live from uh, downtown Florida. My name is Adam Price. Have a nice day. What are we like on air or something? Whoa, oh! <laughs> oh. <laughs> are you serious? Clyde's back! Clyde's back! Ladies and gentlemen, Clyde Juicy Jenkins has returned to In Your Face News for the juicy throwback of the week. Check it. That's right, ladies and gentlemen. Clyde Juicy Jenkins is back. You dig? Now here's with another juicy throwback. If y'all didn't know, I was really into the grooves back in the day. Matter of fact, I remember, uh, hey, what was the, um, 1980. Yeah, my man Curtis Blow and my best friend, some might even call us brothers, Don Cornelius. We was on Soul Train, and I swear, I was there, Jack. I, w I was there. I was there. Go, go, go to the clip. We got the clip. Go to the clip. Let's get some hands together, gang, for Mr. Curtis Blow. Yeah, I don't know what you're looking at right now, but if you see in the front, the front area, I, I swear I'm there. Yeah, man, I was there, I was dancing, me and Don Cornelius was getting down, man. And then some Jack stepped on my sneakers. I said, say, Jack, you stepped on my sneakers. I cost about $40, man. $40. Well, that's another reminiscence of another juicy throwback. Back to you, Phil. Ooh, so juicy. I still cannot believe that man is back, the legend himself. Well, viewers, we have something very special to end our show with. Right now, we're gonna kick it to 
app dog and bouncy ball Game vicious, curl game. Ooh, wee. You a jab turkey. I'm like Bruce Lee. Chickens don't cluck, or you'll end up with a two piece. Man, I don't play no games. If you ask that dog, he'll tell you the same. With my kung fu shirt and my kung fu shoes. Ha! Watch me do what it do. Now let the ball. We put go. the words on the screen and we make the ball bounce. bounce. So you can sing along to the beat and keep count. count. You feel me? That's what it's all about. Yeah. Follow that southern swing and not even from the south. No. Don't have to understand the words that's coming out my mouth. Uh-uh. Close captions in English, what the bouncy ball's about. Yeah. Read along, boys and girls, it's just like karaoke. Uh-huh. Teach you the master to bounce like Obi-Wan Kenobi. Bouncy, bouncy, ball, ball. Yeah. Bouncy, bouncy, ball, ball. Make that ball go. Bouncy, bouncy, ball, ball. Yeah. We make that ball go. Bounce, bounce. We make that ball go. Bounce, bounce. We make that ball go. Bounce, bounce, we make that ball go. Bounce, 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 bounce. 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 